GoGriffins.com, powered by Spine and Sport Physical Therapy. Your first choice, the right choice. As a former national champion volleyball coach, Corey Frederick stands on solid ground. Keep everybody calm and in our system. Let's go. But in another life, he'd rather be underwater. <laughs> I wish I had lungs or gills instead of lungs, but. So you could come back in another life as a fish. Oh, I'd hope so. As long as I don't get eaten by a shark. They don't eat people like everybody thinks, but they do eat fish. That still doesn't stop him now because he literally swims with the sharks. It's just being in another world. A world he travels to most every summer. Well, there's something, you, there's no way to experience that up here on the surface. In his free time, Frederick is an underwater diver and an amateur underwater photographer. These are just a few examples of thousands of pictures he's taken. For some reason, I've always liked marine animals since I was a kid. I can remember reading books about the whales, about whale sharks. Um, I've just always been interested in that for some reason. Had a chance to start diving about 10, about 10 years ago now. Um, just stumbled into it, the, a resort course at a place we were staying, did a couple of dives and amazingly I was throwing up the whole time because I was seasick and still went back and did it again. Now he's an expert of sorts, Frederick has been all over the ocean. One of his most memorable trips, he says, was to the Sakura Islands where he got up close and personal with humpback whales. It's just like being in another world, you've never seen something as big as what these animals are, it's just you can't, it's like swimming next to something that's bigger than a semi underwater. It's just unbelievable. And if you're looking for a correlation between this and volleyball, don't expect to find one. I've never seen a volleyball court on a boat where I'm at. Yeah, it just doesn't, doesn't, doesn't exist. Nope, this is just a hobby, which on the surface seems dangerous. But Frederick insists he's not a reckless thrill seeker. You know, driving home tonight from here to Kansas City is going to be much more dangerous than me getting in the water with these tiger sharks that I've been in with. It's just, it's just like everything else. You have to know what you're doing and, and be halfway intelligent while you're under there, but if you pay attention, it's fairly safe.